if they have a lot of decayed teeth or gum disease and really their only option other than implants is, is dentures. So if that's the case, then they're a good candidate for all the next. And at that point, we would look at bone levels, uh, their sinuses, you know, anatomical considerations to plan the case. Things that could be contraindications to implant treatment in general is diabetes, depending on the level of control, smoking, and radiation to, uh, to the head and neck area. The zirconium prosthesis is going to give you the closest form and function in terms of what we can give compared to normal teeth. If you take care of it and preserve the bone levels around the implant, then that implant will last as long as there's bone around it. If you're feeling like it's time for a change and you're ready for improved oral health and increased confidence, I would love for you to reach out to us at Seattle's Best Smiles for a free consultation and we can discuss with you what we can do to get your smile back.